so welcome back uh, dear friends i hope you all are good now see here uh, whatever uh, now today we are going to discuss or this topic acid bases and salts so that acid bases and salts topic it is for your 10th uh, standard also and uh, for your whenever we uh, you saw at the time of uh, your homeopathy exams okay in that also what this topic were present acids bases and salts okay means this topic for both competitive competition as well as your uh, regular ncert 10th standard book also okay like that uh, uh, we saw a previous our topic chemical reactions and equation from that also some part of your ncert and some part for what competitive exam that is for homeopathy also okay so see here acids bases and salts so first thing what are acids okay acids uh, uh, you may observe for thousand years uh, ago okay some species like uh, lemon juice okay lemon juice then our vinegar also they taste was what yes taste was what sour taste and uh, some different foods also they taste what sour but uh, uh, why this taste is so okay it was found uh, what this uh, 100 years ago only okay so this thing is very much important here okay why means why that whatever your lemon juice whatever vinegar this taste are source that uh, whatever discovery okay it before 100 years they discovered okay because it contain what acids yes what acids so but acids it is a basically this word came from what latin name one of the latin name okay so we call it as what acids acids means what meaning means here say acids means means so okay understood so like that uh, as you know tamarind also there also uh, taste uh, sour okay so like that acidus this latin name acidus this acidus means what sour okay so uh, consequently what will happen uh, discovered some uh, bases also and as you know bases having taste what bitter in taste okay bases what bitter in taste okay so as you know uh, some bases also there uh, naoh koh these are what uh, yes strong bases okay now uh, whatever this uh, uh, in previous years uh, whatever they discovered okay uh, so we can't predict uh, nature and uh, whatever physical and chemical properties Chem mostly what chemical properties of that acids and bases up till that uh, means uh, as you know they are so but from that we can't predict uh, their nature their uh, behavior with a uh, chemical reactions okay so at that time uh, after that what uh, they will discover yes some theory was proposed at that time okay some scientists they gave theories about this okay so see here after that uh, we will discuss acid bases or or whatever that history okay then uh, with the help of acid base chemistry okay some uh, salts also uh, discovered means uh, as you know acid plus base what you will get yes you will get salt simply along with water okay this is a normal reaction acid plus base they gives what salt plus water okay means whatever salt also uh, after that a uh, discovery will uh, happen okay so here mostly we are discussing here acids bases and salts okay now we will uh, going to discuss here some theories of acids bases okay so see here in that uh, which theories are there first theory okay and as you know acids nature also yes acids are sour in taste okay or uh, they gave a color what yes blue to red color uh, of a litmus paper okay so we these are what very much important here whatever uh, some uh, physical uh, basic things okay so after that uh, yes uh, next scientists were propose one theory okay 
अरेनियस कंसेप्ट ऑफ एसिड्स एंड बेसिस ओके अरेनियस फर्स्ट थेरीज ऑफ एसिड अरेनियस कंसेप्ट ऑफ एसिड्स एंड बेसिस ओके सो सी इन दैट अरेनियस कंसेप्ट वॉट दे आर सेइंग सो अकॉर्डिंग टू दिस एसिड्स से एसिड्स आर वॉट अकॉर्डिंग टू अरेनियस कंसेप्ट ओके सो अकॉर्डिंग टू दिस द एसिड इज प्रोड्यूसेस एच प्लस आइंस इन देयर एक्वेज सोल्यूशन वॉट आर बेड एसिड्स इयर अकॉर्डिंग टू अरेनियस कंसेप्ट एसिड्स आर एसिड्स आर प्रोड्यूसेस हाइड्रोजन आयन हाइड्रोजन आयन इन देर इन देर वेर येस एक्वियस सोल्यूशंस ओके दीज आर वॉट युअर एसिड्स अंडरस्टूड एच प्लस आई एम प्रोड्यूस इन वेर येस वेर इन aqueous solution okay so we will uh, see uh, some examples okay so that you know examples suppose i wrote here nitric acid yes hno3 so beta how it dissociates okay how it dissociates so see how it dissociates hno3 aqueous so beta uh, we can uh, show this with uh, simple arrow see not reversible arrow so see h plus plus no3 minus yes h plus plus no3 minus means h plus aqueous here we'll get an no3 minus aqueous here we will get understood so these are what here this acid produces h plus ions in aqueous solutions understood so these are what hydrogen ion and this what we call it as a what nitrate ion nitrate ion uh, nitrate ion the nitrite ion we studied previously in 9th standard also okay so see here uh, like that uh, we can dissociate suppose uh, it is what beta acid uh, we will discuss some uh, weak acid also okay so see here example suppose this ch3cooh okay this is what beta acidic acid see here acetic acid or we can say vinegar or ethanoic acid understood so see how it dissociates it ch3coo minus so we call it as a word acetate ion plus aqueous state plus what h plus is it is also what aqueous understood so acetate ion along with what h plus ions okay so these are some uh, simple uh, reactions here okay so we will uh, see uh, some other also there hcl h3po4 like that uh, we can form what dissociation okay in aqueous solution means basically arrhenius according to arrhenius what yes they are producing what h plus ions in aqueous solution okay so one of the interesting thing here uh, happen okay so that thing is what okay on dissolution okay wherever uh, whatever we are dissolving on dissolution what will happen yes h plus ions will uh, separate out along with their an anion part means h plus plus no3 minus or we can say ch3co minus plus h plus like that uh, only we discuss here but whenever this h plus ions are forming in acidic solution okay it is what unstable it is what quite unstable okay so this unstable so it will what it will uh, acquire stability they want stability so what will happen this whatever this h plus okay whatever this h plus it will further reacts with your h2 so what will happen yes it will what h3o plus we will get and this h3o plus we call it as a what hydronium ion hydronium ion understood so it is a, one of the interesting thing here means we are saying yes h plus they are producing in aqueous solution but whatever this h plus is unstable in aqueous solution so to gain stability to attain stability it will further react with this h2o and it becomes stabilized and uh, we will discuss whatever property 
of that acid it depends on what h3o plus ion so obviously this h plus unstable so it becomes what here quite stable what is that h3o plus understood so whatever that acidic property of an acid acidic property of an acid uh, in aqueous solution it depends on what hydronium ions hydronium ions so we will discuss some uh, another examples okay see uh, what will happen suppose we will discuss hcl hcl plus h2o so what will happen here yes that h plus they are uh, evolving okay h plus they are producing uh, it will what will happen see cl minus plus h3o plus we are getting means here we wrote directly understood whatever h plus here produce it will react with water because it is in aqueous hcl water means what hcl is in aqueous state understood so here you will get like this okay suppose if you are thinking like this h2so4 so see this h2so4 plus h2o means dilute sulfuric acid dilute solution with acid plus water dilute solution or we can say these are what aqueous solution so what here you will get yes hso4 minus plus what one of the h here so h3o plus hydronium ion then now only we discuss whatever property of that acid it depends on what is true hydronium ion present in that solution okay so these are about what simply your acids according to arrhenius concept now see we will discuss base okay base so what is a basis according to what arrhenius concept okay so bases are what they are producing oh minus ions in aqueous solution bases are producing yes producing oh minus ion in where aqueous solutions understood okay so as you know here suppose i am writing here naoh naoh aqueous so what here what will happen na plus aqueous plus what oh minus aqueous okay so basic property here it depends on what oh minus how much hydroxide ion is produced so see what we call this oh minus ion hydroxide ion okay suppose if you are discussing this nh4oh minus okay sorry nh4oh simply what ammonium hydroxide okay this what beta ammonium ammonium hydroxide okay whatever this nh4 we call it as the word ammonium and this oh is what hydroxide so what you will get here yes nh4 plus plus oh minus understood so very much easy this but in chemistry we have to revise all whatever in previous standard whatever nine standard topic atoms and molecules okay from that our various formulas cross over valency is most important okay so we will uh, move towards uh, next okay lowry bronsted concept of acid and bases next our second we will discuss second okay so see here whatever this second okay lowry bronsted concept of acids and bases okay so lowry bronsted concept what they are saying see here okay so according to lowry bronsted concept okay whatever your acids are okay acids are what proton donor and bases are what proton acceptor understood according to lowry bronsted concept what he discovered this in uh, where 1923 okay so according to lowry bronsted concept acids are yes proton donor 
एंड बेसिस बेसिस आर वॉट ये बेसिस आर प्रोटोन ये वॉट एक्सेप्टर अंडरस्टूड सो वेरी मच इंपॉर्टेंट दिस थिंग एसिड्स आर प्रोटोन डोनर एंड बेसिस आर प्रोटोन एक्सेप्टर सो वी विल सी सम एग्जाम्पल हियर ओके so now only we saw that example but uh, we have to see here in another way so say i'm going to discuss that example okay so but this uh, what your definition you have to keep in mind ready for that so see here what your your acids okay see hcl plus h2o okay so as you know hcl is what hydrochloric acid okay hydrochloric acid and water here what base beta one thing here you keep in mind your water is what amphoteric in nature water is what amphoteric in nature amphoteric means what whatever your water is act as a both acids as well as bases acid as well as bases okay so here acid strongest is what your acid so at that time we water is what will act as a it act as a base okay so now only we discuss here in our uh, this content what our lowry bronsted concept your acids is what proton donor so acid here okay proton donor donating to what base and whatever donating whatever this donor proton okay so that proton will accept who will accept base will accept okay so see here very much easy and uh, simple this concept so here okay see h plus so what will happen beta here yes see here cl minus will Of occur because beta this acid this donate a proton that's why what will happen here Cl minus and this H plus base will accept because base is what proton acceptor plus H3O plus okay so always keep in mind here one of the most important concept here will occur that what whatever your acids they are forming conjugated base these are what beta conjugated base and here base they will form what yes conjugated acid keep in mind this whatever your your acid they are forming what conjugated base and base will form what conjugated acid understood so we will see some ex uh, another example also ready for that so understood this uh, clearly example okay so we will move towards next suppose i will write this okay simply hno3 okay see so here एच एन ओ थ्री प्लस एच टू सो एज यू नो वॉट इयर येस इयर एच एन ओ थ्री इज युअर एसिड सो ऑब्विस्ली इज युअर युअर वॉटर इज वॉट बेस ओके सो युअर एसिड इज प्रॉपर्ट इज वॉट प्रोटोन डोन आर एंड बेस इज वॉट प्रोटोन एक्सेप्टर येस इयर वॉट विल आपन एच एन ओ थ्री येस एन ओ थ्री माइनस प्रोटोन को अलग कर दिया इधर so whatever that proton who will accept that water h3o plus hydronium okay so this acid what will form here conjugated base okay conjugated base and this base what will form conjugated yes acid understood so here very much important here this example i hope you understood all this examples okay clear we will move to us next so see lowry bronsted concept okay 
same thing is in uh, your higher standard also don't worry okay so see here next one so put i will wrote this here another example ready see you are beta here h2o plus ammonia h2o plus ammonia so here beta your ammonia is what yes your ammonia is what here base and obviously here water is what acid so what will happen here c it is your acid and is what base ammonia base why it is base because it is a reason reasoning first type question they will ask why it is base ammonia is base because presence of lone pair on this nitrogen atom okay we have answer also why it is base so beta if this base so as i already told water is what amphoteric say so the spelling of that okay so so spelling amphoteric amphoteric in nature okay means they will react with what acid as well as or they can act as a acid as well as base so uh, we saw uh, in previous amphoteric oxides also okay like that you have to compare with yourself amphoteric oxide also uh, we studied in that example you are guessing which example it is yes al23 okay is what your amphoteric oxide understood so here um, what will happen as you know acids they are uh, proton donor so if we donate one proton what will happen oh it's minus and your ammonia ion it will take that proton and becomes nh4 plus nh4 plus so beta here what will happen whatever this acids they are producing what oh it's minus is higher hydroxide ion means base so i said is what here conjugated conjugated base and this base is what producing conjugated yes conjugated here acid they are producing understood so very much easy such type of okay so uh, we can uh, take another example also or you you can write in your notebook okay so take water plus carbonate ion so you have to write this Uh, example okay in your notebook understood so here we discuss beta both simultaneously whatever your acids and whatever your bases okay acids is what proton donor bases is what proton acceptor understood so uh, whatever i told yes water plus carbonate ion so you have to write in your notebook and uh, you have to tell me uh, what whichever your conjugate base and whichever conjugate acid with a formula you have to write okay so here in chemistry as you know chemical formulas are most important okay so see here next next we will discuss but beta here one important okay in important here advantage of this lowry bronsted concept okay what he explain whatever your uh, he explain the behavior of acid and bases he explain the behavior of acid and bases in any type of solvent it is what your advantage of this concept lowry bronsted concept so we will move towards next so third hour that is lewis acid base concept what beta lewis say sometimes uh, uh, with another name lewis also lewis acid base concept so see here lewis acid base concept third important so these three are very much important here for your higher standard also okay so keep in mind this you have to do like that comparatively study 
ओके सपोज वी डिस्कस सम ऑक्साइड्स और वाटर इट एक्ट एज एम्फोटरिक एम्फोटरिक इन नेचर सो दिस थिंग समवेर यू हर्ड दिस वर्ड एम्फोटरिक सो इमिजिएटली यू हैव टू लुक आउट वॉट एवर वी स्टडी एम्फोटरिक ऑक्साइड्स ऑल्सो सो अगेन यू रिवाइज दैट ओके विथ एच सी एल एंड विथ एन ओ एच वी स्टडी द रिएक्शन एल टू थ्री प्लस एन ओ एच एल टू थ्री प्लस एच सी एल ओके सो वन थिंग इज वॉट माय हम्बल रिक्वेस्ट हियर यू हैव टू डू कंपेरेटिवली स्टडी सो इट इट्स अ बेटर टू रिटेन इन युअर मेमरी ओके होप यू फॉलो दिस सो वी विल सी हियर नेक्स्ट अवर लेविस एसिड बेस कंसेप्ट सो अकॉर्डिंग टू दिस एसिड्स सो हियर से एसिड्स आर ओके एसिड्स आर इलेक्ट्रॉन पेयर एक्सेप्टर ओके लेविस एसिड इज वॉट बिडा इलेक्ट्रॉन पेयर एक्सेप्टर ओके एंड बेसिस बेसिस आर इलेक्ट्रॉन पेयर वॉट डोनर सो वेरी मच इम्पॉर्टंट हियर दिस definition in short you have to uh, revise you have to memorize this all this uh, three uh, theories of the acid and bases okay so in the arrhenius the lowry brown state okay then this what here lewis acid base okay so we will discuss here uh, with a example okay so see here with a example we will discuss what will happen see see whatever this uh, he h plus what beta this h plus plus ammonia plus what beta ammonia so as you know this ammonia and you know octet rule also so see this ammonia is correctly uh, wrote 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 so here octet is complete so it is a correct structure of your ammonia okay so h plus so here we have to identify lewis acid and lewis base also lewis acid and lewis base so see here whatever h plus so see we will observe here easily h plus h plus in chemistry as you know plus means minus one that okay so again this word electron deficient electron ke bhuke hai wo okay so means what here h plus is what beta electron deficient deficient and is what beta yes electron rich electron rich and electron deficient okay so very much easy this h plus as you know how much your hydrogen atomic number 1 so again if you done plus so then what will remain one minus this again plus one zero so it will what electron deficient only okay understood this so see here and we discuss this uh, whatever a hydrogen uh, in our advanced concept also in structure of atom advanced concept uh, you can uh, see again uh, that video Uh, from our 9c class hydrogen atomic number 1 1s1 okay if plus 1 so what will happen 1s0 it will occur okay so it is what for highest standard only but suppose you are writing here 1 so that 1 minus again this 1 0 only okay so electron deficient and electron deficient we call it as a what yes lewis acid and this what beta yes lewis base understood lewis acid and lewis base so as you know lewis acid now only we define electron pair acceptor because they want wo electron ko bhuke hai electron ke bhuke wo do unke chahiye electron chahiye unko okay so what will happen here say your h plus so hydrogen so nitrogen they are what giving 
ओके सो लाइक दैट एरो वाई लाइक दैट एरो बिकॉज नाइट्रोजन इज शेयरिंग इर इलेक्ट्रॉन टो सो हाइड्रोजन टू प्लेट विल कंप्लीट टू प्लेट टू इलेक्ट्रॉन्स ओके एंड ऑब्विस्ली वॉट विल अपन नाइट्रोजन ऑक्टेड ऑल्सो इट रिमेन्स सेम ओके सो वे कॉल इट एज अ वर्ड हियर एन एच फोर प्लस हियर वे कॉल इट एज अ वर्ड डेज येस अमोनियम आयन अमोनियम आयन वॉट एवर हियर दिस फॉर्म ओके अमोनियम आयन वी सॉ इन रिएक्शन ऑल्सो एन एच फोर प्लस वे विल गेट ओके so uh, such type of uh, we have to do and uh, we also call this the, the adduct whatever here form we call it as a what adduct okay we will write here whatever this form we call it as a what adduct okay and here whatever here bond is prepared that bond we call it as a see what we call it that bond coordinate कोवैलेंट बॉन्ड कोऑर्डिनेट कोवैलेंट बॉन्ड वी कॉल कोऑर्डिनेट कोवैलेंट बॉन्ड सिंपली एज यू नो मेटल नॉन मेटल आयोनिक नॉन मेटल नॉन मेटल यस कोवैलेंट यस यर नॉन मेटल नॉन मेटल कोवैलेंट बॉन्ड एज वी डिस्कस इन अवर मेटल्स एंड नॉन मेटल ब्रीफली विथ एग्जाम्पल्स ओके so with the hero because nitrogen they are giving electron that give sharing here electron pair with the hydrogen we so we call it is a what coordinate covalent bond okay so understood this all concept here electron deficient lewis acid then electron rich lewis base okay we will uh, see one more here example of our this lewis acid and base concept so that is very much important for your this year then uh, homeopa competitive exam and for your higher standard also ready so see here we will discuss as you know this boron trifluoride boron trifluoride plus what Ammonia, okay. So say this ammonia. You are observing this, okay. So, beta here electron deficient species present. Yes, here present. How we can identify beta here electron deficient is present or not with the help of central atom. Always keep in mind whatever electron deficient species we have to identify with central atom. so see here boron as you know boron atomic number 5 so 2 comma 3 understood so beta they want okay they want electron to complete its octet okay so see here means here what your bf3 is what beta here electron deficient okay and this what already we discuss electron rich okay so from this we can conclude whatever your electron deficient we call it as a word because they are accepting lone pair of electron so lewis lewis acid lewis acid and here what lewis yes base lewis base understood so after that here again same here it will form like that fluorine then boron this trifluoride they want to complete its octet so suppose as we see here 1 2 3 4 5 6 6 so here they want to two electron to complete its octet here okay so nitrogen they are giving us means proton whatever electron pair okay electron pair here donate okay these are what acceptor these are what donor okay so donor we call it as what basis so see as like your arrow nitrogen hydrogen 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 so here what adduct okay here adduct will form on whatever this bond will form it act as what coordinate covalent bond 
okay simply we call it as a what a duct one of the complex we can uh, here uh, say like this okay so understood you all this whatever our this lewis acid base concept also okay so here some examples we will say here types of lewis acids we will discuss here what types of lewis acid okay so see in that types of lewis acid what uh, uh, which uh, types here in that types of lewis acid so see here first type is what okay first type the molecules having the molecules having having central atom having central atom with central atom with incomplete octet with what beta incomplete octet central atom with incomplete octet for example as you know for example see here anhydrous anhydrous bf3 then alcl3 so these are what beta lewis acids here examples lewis acids okay second we will discuss here simple cations so simple cations see here simple cations in simple cations what do you all simple cations all simple cations such as okay uh, whatever that simple cations these are what electron electron deficient electron ke bhuke electron deficient they want electron to complete its octet for example see here na plus na plus k plus then as you know your h plus ag plus k etc these are what beta simple cations but they are what your lewis acids but they are what here lewis acids okay so we will see here third so in that third we will discuss molecule in which the molecules molecules in which okay the central atom has in which the central atom has incomplete okay central atom has sorry incomplete not vacant vacant d orbital d orbital vacant d orbitals okay and 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 may acquire and may acquire more than more than 8 electrons more than 8 electrons okay or we can say more than 8 electron means what they are expanding their octet rule expanding their octet rule such as example so many examples uh, uh, we can say sf6 are there okay so uh, these are what your expanded octet rule pf5 okay these are also what expanding octet rule okay so that species is act as a what your lewis acid we will say here uh, example one example we will say sif4 so this sif4 example if you are considering this sif4 example in that silicon is what your atomic number yes atomic number 14 so beta here 284 so yes it has what vacant d orbital so that vacant d orbital uh, in our uh, uh, structure of atom it is what with a higher uh, advanced uh, theory in 1s to 2s to we can now uh, say in ninth standard uh, or you may uh, uh, go through uh, that uh, video uh, ninth standard uh, i already uh, uh, submitted okay i already added in playlist also ninth uh, chemistry okay you can say 
and you can uh, ask your doubts also okay so suppose if you are elaborating this you are whatever uh, in that types so, of uh, what levis i said si4 okay see here si silicon 14 yes atomic number sodium then magnesium aluminium silicon okay phosphorus sulfur then here 284 beta 2.84 but if you are saying with the help of advanced theory their electronic configuration like this 1s2 2s2 2p6 3s2 what here 3p2 so see here okay you are observing here 2 to 4 4 plus 6 here 10 plus 2 12 and here what beta 12 plus 2 14 so 1s to 2s to 2p6 3s to 3p2 okay so see this here this what 3p2 so it has whatever after that okay 4s then 3d so this what beta incomplete only incomplete or we can say vacant vacant orbitals vacant orbitals so we call it as a what Lewis acid so whatever the applications of this Lewis acid we have to use so it is what their application means this we have to use in higher standard in 11 and 12 standard okay so one thing you as a keep in mind here as an example of Lewis acid SI4 in that vacant D orbitals are there okay or we can say what they may acquire expanded octet rule also okay so one of the here important fourth also we can say the molecules in which the molecules in which atoms of different in which atoms of different electronegativity different electro negative are linked by are linked by multiple bonds linked by what beta multiple bonds so see here molecules in which atoms of different electronegative whatever elements are there are linked by multiple bonds so see here how we can identify this different electronegative so say we discuss electronegativity in our periodic classification of elements so see suppose you have you are taking example of co2 okay in that but must be multiple bond multiple bond means either double or triple bond so see here if you are elaborating this c double bond o and double bond o yes here delta plus here delta minus means partial here negative charge will develop because your oxygen is more electronegative than carbon okay so multiple bonds see here and they are completing their octet also see this carbon 1 2 3 4 5 6 and 7 8 and for this oxygen 1 2 3 4 5 6 and 7 8 this oxygen 1 2 3 4 5 6 and 7 8 okay so our example also correct okay suppose if you are saying next so3 like that here these also are joined by multiple bonds okay so here delta plus here delta minus delta minus and delta minus means what here but i hear electronegative difference is there whatever your sulfur is electropositive and uh, your oxygen is what more electronegative than therefore it is positive okay so whatever these are applications in your what higher standard of this but here you have to keep in mind for your uh, what competitive exams okay so we will discuss types of Lewis bases also okay we will discuss here what types of Lewis bases so see here in that types of uh, Lewis bases types of Lewis bases so see here types of Lewis bases uh, here first we will discuss these are one neutral molecules okay some say the neutral the neutral molecules okay with with at least one at least one 
लोन पेयर ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन लोन पेयर ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन सो एज यू नो एग्जाम्पल लेविस बेस योर अमोनिया एन एस थ्री दीज आर वॉट एग्जाम्पल एट लीस्ट वन लोन पेयर ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन दैट कैन एक्ट इज वॉट लेविस बेसिस ओके सेकेंड वी कैन हियर राइट सम एनाइंस ऑल्सो दे एनाइंस एनाइंस having an ions having negative charge an ions having negative charge they can act as what lewis bases so example we will discuss here f minus cl minus oh minus etc they can act as what beta here f minus cl minus oh minus they can act as what your lewis bases okay so here uh, one of the important concept we discuss okay so this what our lecture today's lecture in which uh, we discuss uh, what are acids where it names came then bases okay bitter in taste okay uh, so we discuss could not uh, explain the all properties on the basis of this only with the help of taste so th some theories were uh, proposed arrhenius then uh, lowry bronsted lewis acid we saw with their examples i hope you all understood all this okay so you have to revise this all understood so uh, take care stay safe uh, thank you